All right, here we go, folks. This is uh, me, and I'm trying to take care of all these shrubs here. Um, I'm trying to trim them down so they look kind of like a bonsai trees. That's the plan, at least. It's like uh, a lot of really overgrown shrubs in here. I don't even know what kind of trees those are. If anyone can tell me, let me know. This is uh, my camera having problems, so I skip spots for a while here. Um, these are all the branches I got to haul away. We'll go through some speedier times every once in a while. And there'll be some slow times when you don't see much going on. I edited out some of the stuff. But that see that that one tree on the on the right there with the two branches that one I'm gonna keep like that for now see what happens have to trim some down because they uh, they uh, just have way too many branches they're like 20 feet wide they're like 20 feet away from the from the lot line the branches go. It's very windy, so the sound on the thing, all it was, was blowing in it, you know, like that the whole time. So it's kind of annoying. That's me. I'll just take these over to the street. I guess these will go to the street too. Maybe I'll just throw them off to the side. I can't remember. I did that a few times. It's kind of funny how every time you pick up a branch, you end up stepping on one of the other branches of it, and you have to move your foot. And no matter how many times you try it. That was a bird nest or something, uh, or a birdhouse that I found laying inside there. I just had to get rid of it. Well, yeah, another another bad thing about where I live is that you hear the street noise all the time. And yeah, that's my uh, electric corded chainsaw I use. Greenworks. It's pretty nice, actually. Cuts right through stuff. The only problem is, is that cord gets in the way. I'm going to see if I can pick up a cordless one, but I'm in no hurry to waste money right now. Especially during the, the lockdown. This will speed up after a while and we'll see a lot of, a lot of stuff. It's another short video though. I keep finding branches that are cracked. I'll have a close-up of some later on. But the, the cracked one, like, you see right right behind me, the, those, those two are one tree on the right corner, bottom right corner. That one had a crack in it, had a, another branch going off. So I just got to see if any of these... Any of these keep going. This next one right here has the top, the whole top part, which would have been really cool. It would have looked like a big umbrella, but uh, I had to get rid of it. It was like three different cracks in it all the way up.
Oh yeah, now I remember what I was doing here. Yeah, he, uh, uh, I was cutting off this branch and it was like going into the ground and I didn't want to dig my chainsaw into the ground here. So I think I take off after a, a second here. You'll see me walk out of frame and then come back. I was trying to break off this log, or the one branch that was there. Kept having to grab more tools. It always seems you go out there with one tool that you think you're going to need the whole thing, and then you have to grab like four more. That is the problems. That was me and my grumpy walking. Yep, see? There I got the loppers. They were a little sticky there, that's why I was like, what's going on? That was the troublesome one. Yeah, I sped it up, I think, here. What am I doing? What am I doing? See, that's another good thing about those trees. You got places to put your tools. Uh oh here comes my fancy camera work. Look out. You can see it right at the very bottom of the screen there. In the middle there, that's a crack there. It's kind of greenish there. Yeah, that's a big crack where all the all the pine needles or the needles were getting caught in there and rotting, so that whole thing was all rotted. Yep. So I tried to save this tree. We'll see what happens with it. Got to cut out this part. And here comes that I think the cool branch that after I cut it, maybe maybe two more. Yeah, see that one was all just one big umbrella. I think that one would look cool if I could have kept it. It has a big branch too. It's another big branch that was real low. And we're coming up on the end here. My battery died. I kept working for a little bit, but I'll probably put some more up about this working on it. As I get better with the canvas, it'll be more interesting. 
See you later.